Many things are returning to their pre-pandemic state, except for the stress Americans feel when it comes to money. The pandemic has increased America's stress about money, not only because of loss of jobs, but because of debt, lack of savings, and uncertainties about the future. Americans' anxiety about money is almost identical to what it was last year, according to a recent study done by Next Advisor. Financial anxiety can look very different depending on the person. Symptoms may include overspending, hoarding, having a fear of spending, having uncontrollable finances, depression, and even obsessive behavior such as continually checking your online bank account. For almost three decades, CPA Howard Dvorkin has been helping people get on the path towards financial freedom by overcoming their financial anxiety. One thing I see in today's world that really needs to be talked about more is discarding financial shame. Stop comparing your lifestyle or spending habits to others, especially those on social media. That will only increase your financial anxiety. Spending and accumulating wealth is not a contest. Additional steps that Vorkin recommends to overcome financial anxiety are to write down what specific factors are causing your anxiety. Depending on what they are, you may be able to avoid the anxiety. Create a budget that meets your goals. Keep track of your spending, why you spent, and how it makes you feel. This will help you understand where your money is going and why. Seeing the bigger picture may help you spend less. Be okay with change. Your current financial situation may not be ideal, but it's not forever. And lastly, prepare, but don't forget to live. You can build up your savings while also pursuing other financial goals. Stress and anxiety in our financial lives has a direct impact on our physical and mental health. When you overcome financial anxiety, you're not only feeling better, your finances start looking better. For more news and information, visit Debt.com's YouTube channel. And if you need help getting out of debt, visit Debt.com today.